The Panasonic S5 Mark II is loaded with the new Lumix Active IS image stabilization technology, which takes IBIS to the next level. Whether you're a run and gun filmmaker looking for excellent handheld results, a vlogger, or if you wanna do long exposure photography, this has you covered. The compensation offered by the S5 Mark II is on a whole other level, even from the prior generation of Lumix cameras. We get far better compensation, allowing us to get up to 200% better performance, especially in the corners for those larger shakes. While Panasonic offers a wide range of lenses, I didn't do the camera any favors in those tests. I used the lenses that don't actually have any optical image stabilization. For the best in stabilization, the S5 Mark II is on a whole other level. And just for my own tests, I wanted to see how it compared up against the Panasonic GH6. I actually think this performed better. Let's take a look. After looking back at the footage, it was a huge surprise to see that the S5 Mark II outperformed the legendary GH6 in-body image stabilization. So yeah, this is on a whole new level. In addition to the standard active IS mode, there's also a secondary mode called IS Boost. And this allows you to get an almost tripod-like locked off shot while you're shooting video handheld. I usually map this custom function button to that option in the menu system, which allows me to turn it on and off even while I'm recording. This allows me to switch between a tripod-like shot and a follow shot at a moment's notice just by using that custom function button on the back. If you're a photographer, you can also benefit from this active IS technology. You can leave the shutter open for up to two plus seconds, which is pretty wild. It's great for capturing motion blur or if you're doing something in a low lit situation. Gimbal shooters will also appreciate a little bit of extra stabilization. If you need more extreme stabilization than what you've seen already, there's also a third mode which brings in digital stabilization. The standard mode works so great that I've never felt the need to turn this on, but it's there if you so choose to use it. Let's do a quick vlogging test using 24 millimeter lenses. Let's try the Panasonic S5 Mark II doing exactly the same walk. So I'm gonna start off slow and then I'm gonna kick it into a little bit of a faster walk. Here we go. I can already tell just looking at the screen how much more stable that was. I'll show you an AB comparison between them both. Here we go.